a while I've been excited about uh, FreeCAD's uh, path workbench because you know, that would possibly be the, the, the um, finally an opportunity to get away from you know the big companies uh, inventor and uh, master cam and get into the open source be able to make some G code some high quality you know pretty much whatever part you want and I haven't had the opportunity to actually test it out on a real part until today so uh, I made this guy for this little part for a um, BattleBot project just a hobby project and this is how it turned out and of course you know some, any of the imperfections most of that comes from the machine itself but you know the g-code did just about everything I wanted it to except the holes I had to do myself it's possible that uh, I didn't like the fact that I was using a quarter inch end mill to make an exactly quarter inch hole I've had issues with g-code programs um, when the hole size is exactly the same as the tool it wants there to be a little bit more so it can kind of spot uh, you know spiral in but you know that I'm sure there's a way to resolve that but um, yeah I've been very impressed they actually have a Gerbil post processor for the g-code which is great when you are running your little CNC router on an Arduino which I am so I, I am excited to see what I can do with this in the future, and I'm happy to see a lot of movement on FreeCAD's development, especially for this kind of long-weighted, um, what I see as a very valuable piece of the puzzle, having the ability to generate G-code for a CNC router or CNC mill. Well, I hope that you find this video interesting. Uh, thank you for watching.